Hello everyone and welcome to Material Energy 4. So since the last episode I haven't had much time to play as of late but what I've been doing recently is breeding up my cattle and I think in there we've managed to get a normal cow so we just get to breed out a few of those guys. I'm going to clear all that out. Yeah, I've even managed to get myself a normal chicken bread. So I can get all the eggs I need now. And another thing I was messing around with is expanding over here for anything I want to do in the future. So I'm just going to leave that for later on. But one other thing I want to do today is try and get hold of some of that adamantium, which I've got in liquid form over in the Nether Sphere 4 there. And uh, the best way of doing it, I found, was using a pump. And the pump we're going to use is the Ender Pump. Now, let me just go over here. So, I, I'm sure I had it stored away here somewhere. I think it was over here, actually. So, we got ourselves a endothermic pump all made up. And I'm grabbing one of those resin energy cells. And all I need to do is get some barrels and some piping. Was there any in there? No. So let's grab some pipes. Now they were called fluid pipes, I think, or were they called liquids? Not too sure. Maybe I left them in there. And I've gone and mislaid my pipes now, <laughs> wherever I put them. Oh, there they are, I had them all along. So, yeah, that's nice and simple. And all we got to do is make up some drums. So let me see if I've got any in here. Nope, I haven't got any made up, so we'll have to make some more. I think we'll make three, that should be enough. So let's see if we can make them now. No, I haven't got them in there. So I'm going to have to make some of these. Oh, would well, you believe it? I haven't got enough iron in there. I've got load in here, so we'll just put that there. Let's throw them in there. I think three of these will be enough, so I've got three of them. And we need some pressure plates, so I'm going to need six of them. That should allow me to make them. What am I short on? Oh, I still got the main inventory, of course. So let's uh, put them in there. That gives me three of them. There's a little bit of lag in here, and I'm going to lower the volume because those withers sure were loud last episode. So I'm going to lower this down to. 8% and see if that does the trick. Okay, let's head on in. Uh, this is where things were getting loud before, if you remember. I haven't left anything in there, have I? So I only need to pop down the end here, really, as I prepared a little area. So once we get over here. Okay, so if we look here, I've set up a little hole where I'm going to do all this now. So what we want to do is, first of all, just get, open that up. There's a Adam Mantine. Oh, I never can say that quite right. So let's free up a few of these things. So you want that and drums. That should do it. Right, now if we put the... let's see, let's put that up there. Okay, and... Let's see, let's... release that one there, and we put the drums in there. And let's put the pipes on top now, so one, two, three... 
four, five. And disconnect up the power. And that should start pumping all that out straight away. Now, I'm thinking that there might be a chest in here as well. As there was in the other nether sphere. So when we've drained all the liquid, let's see if we can find it. So first of all, let's put the pump down. Well, we need power first of all, so we've got to set this up the right way. Just like that, and it should start pumping out that stuff. There we go, perfect. So what we're going to do now is wait for that. And I think there's enough to fill two barrels and a bit, maybe? I don't know. We'll have to see. And how's that doing? I don't think they take too long to fill up, to be honest. But if we look from this angle, we should be able to see what's going on. So let's, uh, let's free up a few of these. Yeah, you can al already see some of it working there. So I'm going to wait for this to drain, and when we come back, we'll empty out the stone and see if there is a secret chest down below. Well, that pump's done its job, it looks it, as the pipes are now empty, so we can claim all these and put them in our inventory now, as we don't want to leave these in the spatial cell, as they will cause problems. So, let's remove these guys. Right, so we've got to use the pickaxe on this one. Thank you very much. Now, let's see if there is actually a chest down here. So I've got a feeling there will be. I've got to be really careful because I don't want to go and fall in the area down below here. So let's get right to the bottom. Ah, there it is. Right, let's see what's in here. So we've got... Ooh, nice. Let's sort that out. We've got four epic bags. Ooh, dense adamantine. And some blocks as well. That's, that's quite good, actually. Let me light that up a second. Right, so let's get out of here and let's dig for the wall because I've already got an area set up by here. Ooh. What happened there then? Let me just release that. Okay, let's get out of there <laughs> before, before the other guys turn up. And let's see what we got everything. Yeah, we got three drums of molten adamantine. Right, so another thing we might need to do down here. Let me like that. There we go up there a second. Yeah, that would could prove a problem if I didn't light that up. Yeah, another thing I need to do down here is actually kill a wither. So that could be a problem. So I'm gonna have to go and get my potions a minute, so let me run up here. Right, so I'm gonna go and get my potions now, and I'm gonna head down to one of those pyramids, and I'm gonna try and enter and kill one of those withers, and I only need to kill one really, because I'm after the quest. So with the quest we've got... I should have opened this up already, but with the quests, I think it was in here. Lost in time. I've got the man time now. Yeah, there was one of these quests that involved killing the weather. I think it was in secrets. Let's see, community spatial lost. Big to win, that's it. So if we look here, we've got an Enderman Killer, and a Creeper Killer, and in the middle we've got Wither Killer. 
And I've just got to kill one of them. And I'll get a quintuple compressed cookie. And with that cookie, I should be able to make... Oh, let's get rid of that. I should be able to make another one. And yeah, that should help me towards get myself some wings eventually. There's three of them. So I'm going to just prepare myself a minute while I do that and I'll meet you down by one of those pyramids where we're going to try and take care of one of those withers. Well this is certainly going to be fun so uh, what I'm going to do is try and get through to this little pyramid here as the guys can't get out and I did find a chest here as well so let's remove that first. Right, so we've got to try and get into here. Oh god, I think we're going to have to go up one more look of it. So let me... Let's grab that back a second. Fancy obsidian brick. Yeah, I want the... Um, let's see, if I open that one there... There we go, we can see in there now, so let's see if we can actually get in there though. First of all, I'm going to have to... Yeah, that doesn't sound too good, does it? <laughs> let's put that there. Let's slowly make our way in there. Eh? So where are they? Over there, right. Okay. This is going to be really careful what I'm doing here. Otherwise, they're going to escape. So I mean, we don't want that. Let's see if I can get one of their attention. Yep, we got one. Right, now I think I better... Uh some of this. So bear with me while I slowly get in there. So if I do that... Okay, the only problem now is we might have some... Uh, not there is. Right, okay, I'm out of it. Let's get a potion on. Okay, I should do it. Let's get out. Let's get him. That's not turning out to... That's not working too well. Okay, this time we're going to take out the spawner itself. Because there is a spawner in the middle there somewhere. So let's quickly get a potion ready again. As it is too many of these guys to take out really. So we're going to have to... Uh, somehow take care of them. Oh. Yeah, this is certainly fun, isn't it? <laughs> I think if I go over here and block this bit... Might not do. Come on, let me out of here. Oh, major battle. 
Alright, block the end. We should be alright now. We just got to... Get rid of the access mobs. Come on. Oh, and he died. <laughs> that was fun. Well, as you can guess, I'm still at it. I died two or three times so far. I lost all my armor. Bit of a disaster, but I went, moved over a little bit and dug in and found myself another chest. And have a guess what's inside. Oh my god, we've got so many gas tiers now. This is going to be crazy. And we've got a nether star generator. So I'm claiming all them for my own. And let's put them away in my AP system. Hopefully I've got room in there. You can't shift click on that for some reason. Let's pull them away and let's claim the rest. Oh boy. There's loads of loot in here. Right, let's grab that. The last of it now. It's everything. Right, let's get rid of that chest. Uh, I don't want to get rid of that spawner somehow. Go, and the spawner should be right in the middle of that. Let's clear that one out. Well. So I'd say right about that spot there. So best way of doing this is to. Guy by that, which I can't. Yeah, so the best way I'd say is to dig a middle area out by zombie. Well, the best way of taking out this spawner is by digging underneath, so that's exactly what I've gone and done. So I'm just slowly making my way over here. And right about here is roughly, I think, where the spawner is. I think we're going to have to move over a couple of blocks, maybe. This, right, let's get that spawner. Let's take us care of this one first. Got room in our inventory. Goodbye, spawner. And we got ourselves a wither spawner. So, we could have some fun with that. But I'll do that later on. For now, I'm gonna get out of here because I don't like this place. And I think I better block the hole up as well because we don't want anything spawning down here, do we? Right. Okay, so let's get out of here now and. Oh my god, in there. Yeah, we're gonna take out all those withers. So I'm getting out of here with my wither spawner in hand. And what I think we'll do is we'll set up a some kind of wither trap later on. And I'm gonna need some better armor to fight this wither. Because my armor's all gone. So it's next to nothing left. And with the adamantine, I think we can make ourselves a better weapon. So I'm going to have a look at a few of those things and we'll see what I get up to in a few minutes. Now, we certainly were having a few problems with those withers. I thought it was going to be straightforward, but I didn't have the right equipment for the job, fortunately. But we're going to have to get some of these different armor types first. So first of all, we need to make ourselves a sword. And let me claim some of these rewards first. Tartarite. Ah, so we need a Tartarite sword. And we're going to get a few quests for that. It's going to be a pretty good armor as well. But we need to get some Tartarite this ice pass mm, we need to find find that do we okay 
Let's see what else we got. Oh yeah, we got the spatial cell there. So let's see how do we make tartrites. Molten tart, right? We need some Adam and some ATL. Now, have I got ATL? I got loads of it. So, if I get myself six blocks of that, I think that should be enough. There's the Adam. Uh, we'll do six blocks of that. Now let's cook this up, and I've got plenty of that stuff to go. So let's see if we got lava in there. Yeah, we got plenty of lava in there. So let's chuck those three in there, and let's wait for that to cook up. All right, that's all smelted now, and we've got 81 ingots. So I think we got enough armor when we make it to go around. So let me grab a couple blocks of these. And I'll probably empty most of this out later on. Let's see now. One more will do it, I think. There we go. Right, now... Let's convert all these into blocks. 36. We probably need one more block. Let's see. All right. Okay, let's convert that over, and let's make some armor out of this. Oh god, those withers do not sound happy down below. So let's make ourselves some of this armor. There's one chest piece, we need some boots. Oh, actually... I think we can get this from the quest, now I remember. Let's see, it was lost in time, open that up. Okay, it was a slight bug there, that didn't update for some reason. Oh, those withers are really lagging out. Let's make a block. I think I should update the quest now. Let's have a look. There we go. So we've got leggings and a helmet. Nice. So let's get rid of this old rubbishy armor and put in the new. Oh, nice. Next up, I think we need a new weapon. Let's make ourselves a sword then. So I'm not sure if I can make. Ah, right. Let's have a look at that. 14 attack damage. Let's see. Swords. Broad swords, 9 attack damage. Let's see what a standard one does. I need a stick. Let's make ourselves a basic sword. That's 9 attack damage, and the other one should be as well. That's 9 attack damage as well, and my current one is 14. And the materials on that are iron. So if I make this sword, it's going to be pretty, pretty good, I think. So let's grab myself a mold. Let's see, where did I put them? Yeah, I don't know what I did with it, so... I'm going to go ahead and make myself a new weapon and maybe I'll go and enchant this stuff up as well. As I probably could do with a bit of enchanting. And when we come back we'll ooh, have a look at this as well. That's pretty tempting. Okay, so give me a few moments and I'm going to sort all them out. 
Well, I've gone ahead and added those enchantments now, so let's have a look what luck I had in them. So, i just done random enchants for now, and maybe we'll improve on them later on. But as you can see, I got our last stand, fire protection, XP boost, protection, XP boost, protection again, in stable 2, and speed 1, and last stand 2. And over on the sword, I managed to get smite. And I've gone ahead and made my Tartoite Broadsword, which I probably have to level up. But I was looking at this Scythe. Now, Scythe can attack their enemies in a range, so maybe we might stick with the Scythe for a while. But we're going to level these two up anyway, so that's something to work on. Now, how these handle the with it is another question so we'll have to try that out and I think I might go with the scythe as there are quite a few withers down there and I think we'll just go and do it now so I'm gonna meet you down there and just to see what happens and here comes the test so let's first of all let's get ourselves a potion Should didn't take. Okay, let's get in there. Now let's test out this thing here. Whether it will be any good, I don't know. But I don't think it's working. <laughs> I can't really tell, to be honest. Yeah, it seems to... I picked up my health quicker than I can regen it. I don't know, but I'll try it anyway. It's kind of working, but I think I better retreat. Oh, right. Let's have a look at that now. Look at the... Oh, it's, it's quite barling that down a little bit, isn't it? Oh, let's get the uh, Tartite sword instead. Let's try that. Where's this guy off? Come yet. So let's try out the sword instead. And let's see what happens there. Oh god, I'm gonna die. Come on, come on. Ooh, that was close. Right, so let's grab a healing potion there. Right, so how long has I got the level up? Well, my armor is certainly kind of holding out. But they are pretty tough. So let's try out the sword now. I think we're going to need another regen potion. Have I got one on me? Yeah, let's try a strength potion and a regen this time. Okay. Should have worked. Now let's try this out again. Certainly uh, getting their health down, but I don't think I'm going to survive this. Let's try the sword instead. Okay, I'm going to have to retreat. So, I definitely need to level up these two weapons before they are more effective than what they are right now. Yeah, definitely. So, oh, better get some uh, food in there. And my armor, well, it's up to 75% already, would you believe? 
So I'm thinking we'll have to come back here again once I've leveled up a bit more. So let me block that off for now. Now put this one out. So I think we'll head to the next spacious set for now and level up these two guys. So I'm going to head back upstairs now and sort out a few things and we'll think about going to the next spacious cell which was called I think it might be called Kerbal's Dream Machine. Let's have a look. Yeah, Kibi's Idea Machine. So that's where we're going to be heading next. So I'll meet you up by the entrance. Okay so we're probably coming near the end of the episode so I'm just going to quickly poke my head in here before the end and we'll see what's inside and with my new equipment now I should be okay oh my god okay that don't sound too good if we look on our radar oh my god <laughs> let's have a quick peek in here Run away, run away, run away. Oh my god. Yeah, definitely. I'm definitely gonna leave this till next episode. So, <laughs> I hope you enjoy watching today, guys. And uh, next time, we're gonna try and clear out all these uh, wolves and we're gonna head into Kibi's idea machine.